The next game on the board here, we are going to uh, Dallas. That's right. The Cowboys hosting the Carolina Panthers. This is a 1 p.m. Eastern time game on Sunday. Cowboys a five-point favorite, total of 50 and a half. And the Cowboys look good on Monday Night Football, didn't they? Yes, they did. Yes, they did. This team is rounding into shape. They look pretty good. Things are going okay. The running game is finally coming on for the Cowboys. And I feel, of course, the Panthers undefeated. And defense looks great. You know, at Sam Darnold, maybe not as bad as everybody assumed him to be. Uh, the matchup in this game to watch, uh, Carolina is is number one in defensive DVOA. Dallas is number six. That is going to be where the game is won. Whoever can can uh, strengthen in their spot the most in that in that position, whoever can push the other one around, uh, because the offense and defense for the Cardinal or Card- God, I cannot talk today. Carolina and Dallas. Carolina's offense number twelve. Dallas defense number fifteen. Overall numbers, Carolina much better than Dallas. I do think Dallas overall is the better football team. Dallas is more tested. It's five. Feels like it might be too many. I don't care. Give me the Cowboys. I think that they I think they end this streak for Carolina. Darnold going on the road. Like give, give me this Cowboys defense here. Panthers might lose this game for the first time all year, but the Panthers won't get beat by five. This is gonna be a close game. They're a good football team. They're gonna keep it tight. They're going to give uh, Dallas fit. I I think the offense is good. The run game won't look as good next week as it did this week. That's just – they're too well coached. They tackle real well. They don't let guys break tackles on them. And uh, and they get after the quarterback and they give you problems. And offensively, I think they got just enough weapons to spread this thing around. Don't need McCaffrey. They'll be fine. Everybody else will pick it up. And, and I think they got a shot to win the game. I absolutely think I like them with, with more than a field goal. Give me, give me the Panthers. Yeah, that's a, I will say that. We didn't bring it up, but McCaffrey being out, like that that does really hurt like to me. But we'll see. Yeah, and to me, it doesn't do anything because it didn't do anything last year. This is what tells you what running backs are valued at. Okay, The Baltimore Ravens, have the worst running back locker room in the country right now, and Baltimore Ravens are the second best run team in football. That's if true. you want to run the football, you just run the damn football. Yeah, but I, I will tell you this: the Panthers don't have Lamar Jackson. Like, and Lamar Jackson has been the guy running the football for the Ravens. So, uh, I, I'm just, but I'm just telling you, they'll find a way to run the ball, and they'll find a way to spread it out. They'll be fine. Uh, Other guys will step up. It'll be okay. On defense, uh, J.C. Horn is out. Uh, C.J. Henderson is questionable. You know, gross, uh, gross Matos, the defensive end, he's doubtful for this game. Like, there's there's a lot of injury concerns on Carolina. It's part of the reason why I think the Cowboys are going to cover. But you got the Panthers plus five, and I can totally understand it because I also am a Matt Rule believer, even though not in this game. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at GaryWCE, at Chris B. Giannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.